Here we'll talk about creating and notating a dominant 11 chord. Let's get back to the scale here. Now, as we said, a dominant chord is one that's a 1, 3, 5, and flat 7 played simultaneously. Now, we talked about using the 9 as an upper tension on a dominant chord, which is the 2 above the octave. 7, 8, 9. Now, we're going to go a step further here and use the 11, which would be, since 8 is the same as 1, 9, 10, 11 would be the same as 4. So essentially, it's a dominant 7 chord, but we're going to add the 4 in here, an octave up. On the keyboard, 1, 3, 5, 7, lower the 7 to make it a dominant chord, and then you've got 8, 9, 10, 11 on the top, to make it a dominant 11 chord. Now, to notate that, you could do it the same way. I'll start over here. You could say C11, or you could say C7, parentheses, 11. 